I'm about to do a sweet ass stunt. Pax, language! I must have been 12 at the time. Wild as winter winds. Sorry. Do a sweet stunt. Watch this. You'll break your neck. Why can't you just use the slide like a normal child? Normal? I am normal. I wasn't. Radical, Ziggy. Don't do that again, Pax. I won't lie. That's a promise I can neither make nor keep. We'll talk about it later. Right now, I need your help, both of you. Oh, man, not pick up a troll. There's snow on the way, and the children left toys everywhere. But we did we pick up a pick troll up yesterday. Troll yesterday. If the toys are left out, they'll be covered in snow and hard to find. This is totally unfair. Totally unfair. The world is unfair, girls. The sooner you start, the sooner you'll finish. We could just leave the rest of them out. That'll be fine. You can't trust kids to pick up after themselves. Why do children just leave toys lying around? Z, are you even helping? How many more of these are there? This must be the last one, right? Kids should be banned from playing with toys. Z, seriously, stop playing and start helping. I'm getting hungry. I think that's the last one. Just need to put them back inside. I think we got them all, Z. We just... just have to put them back now. Z? Ziggy! Where did you go? Hello? Are you hiding in here, Z? Don't even think about trying to scare me. I'll tickle you to death. What's that sound? Whispers. Oh no, the ghosts are back. I have to use the meme too. Shoot, where is it? I must have left it. In the tower, of course. We were still haunted by echoes of the noise. 
That's what we call the broadcast. Over a decade later, there were still whispers that spread like viruses. To some, they were ghosts, demons, evil spirits. But they weren't supernatural. They were just voices. And I was the only one who could see them for what they were. Echoes from the past. And I... Ziggy, are you out there? Z, come on, you brat. Stop playing games. Our castle in the woods. Our secret, secret hideout. If Z wasn't inside Liberty, she'd be out there. In our special place. There you are, you spaz. I could be so mean to Ziggy. Say the worst things. I'm not proud of it, but I was a kid. What are you doing? Hello? Have you seen my meme? I know I left it out here. I hope for your sake you haven't touched it. It's not fair, it's not fair. She always gets her way. I didn't mean it. I was only playing. It's not fair. I wanted to play a game, a game. I played it wasn't fair. It wasn't fun. Why can't I play? Stop putting voices into my head! What are you talking about? <laughs> Kid, I think I know where to find Ziggy. Was that? Uh, nothing. <laughs> what are you doing? Ah, oh, that bell was heavy. I'm in recovery. Ugh, I'm dead. This is me. Dead. You okay there, Boo? You'd think I could deal with a fucking bell after lifting buses, but that motherfucker was hardcore. Ugh, I just need to stay here for a while. Let me know if you need anything. Uh, a tall glass of ice-cold lemonade would be the bomb. Please remember to thank your friend for helping with the bell. Mm. I'm just... You look distracted. The bell... Brought back memories. I see. You need to move on, Pax. Live in the now, not in the past with the ghosts. Remember that electronic device I used to carry around? Your ghost-busting gadget? Huh, I've seen that for years. It wasn't with my stuff. Maybe Ziggy has it? Is... Is that what you came back for? I came for Z. And I think I know where she might be. Her old hideout in the, the forest. The one you girls thought we didn't know about? I don't even know if it's there anymore. I figured I'd find you here, a little castle in the woods. Hey, sis. It's been a while. I'm sure you weren't expecting me. I, uh, it's Pax, believe it or not. Anyway, I'm back, and... I know. You look... Um, you... You've grown up. So... The runaway comes running back. I guess talking to me wasn't high on your list of priorities, huh? Nice to see you too, Z. Oh, sarcasm? A healthy way to deal with conflict. You haven't changed, Pax. At all. What? I, I wasn't... You're the one being sarcastic. I... I what? What were you gonna say? I'm happy to see you. 
That's it? You're happy to see me. Oh, that would have been nice to hear. Like, 15 years ago after you ran out on all of us. This is just... Too little too late. Speaking of running... I'm running late. I'm on kitchen duty and everyone's gonna be expecting dinner. Sis! Ziggy! Oh, shit! Sorry, Mom. I already told you, Fred. We're not buying more guns. The opium was your idea! And the guns! If we're gonna run a drug operation, the least we can do is protect ourselves from- It's not a drug operation. We're making medicine. And making ourselves a target. Same with these strangers you've let into our home. Pax is my daughter. She's a freak. And so are her friends. They're dangerous. That's ridiculous. You've seen what happens when deviants go Nova. Watch your mouth, Fred. You're tearing Liberty apart. What's going on? This is none of your business. Stay out of it. This conversation has nothing to do with you, Pax. Liberty's my home, and Annie's my mom. I'd say it is my business. You haven't changed. You still act like you own the place. I didn't need your help. Did you see your sister? She was on her way to the community kitchen. Always in a rush, that girl. What's going on with... Fred and the others? Oh, it's been brewing for a while. Fred's not happy with my leadership or the choices I've made. <laughs> You'd probably be on her side. So much has changed since she left. What changes are you talking about? Like I told you earlier, people moved away after Rosa got sick. We lost our best craftspeople, and the produce didn't bring in enough money. Those who stayed expected things to just carry on as before, but that was impossible. Lately, there's been so much talk about preserving our way of life, as if things were so much better in the past. Besides, values and traditions don't put food on the table. I had to make changes, or we'd starve. And the poppies caused... Uh, a lot of discontent. I understand the reluctance to change, but I'm only doing what's right for our family. I'll go look for Zig in the kitchen. Careful the whole siding doesn't fall. That's what I'm trying to fix. We don't want another incident like what happened to Harmony. Perhaps we didn't have a TV growing up, kid. Harmony's been saying she may be but we had our live shows. She wouldn't be the only one. What are you saying? I'm saying there are more people who want to get out while they can. Before... Before what? I don't know. I can hear the whispers coming from all around. They're here. Things were better before, with Rosa. Anyone in there? Z? Things were better before, with Rosa. Annie and her kin are sabotaging everything we built. No! Hold your horses, I'm coming. Oopsie. Yeah? This door is locked. You've called the wrong person. No, I know. I just want you to tell me if there's someone in there using Vox. I see. Okay, I can give it a shot. Well, there's someone in there and I'm pretty sure they're vocalizing. Perfect, thank you. You know I just listened, right? You could have done this yourself. What can I say? You've got good ears. Annie doesn't give a fuck about our traditions and customs. She's destroying our way of life. Not quite as threatening now, are you? I haven't had a beer since summer. We should head into town soon. Abuela won't be happy about that. Calling attention to ourselves. Fuck Annie. I doubt they still the serve Sunday brunch. You're right. 
We can't let Abuela destroy every tradition we have. We drive into town, pick up a keg uh, and... Or two? Two kegs and come back here. Have ourselves a private party. Hell yeah, I'll drink to that. Maybe that will quiet the whispers. The what? Ghosts. The fucking ghosts. Right. Yeah. Motherfucking ghosts. What do you want? What are you doing here? What do you want? What are you doing here? You okay? We need to go soon. After what happened last night, I don't want to be on the road after dark. Ah, we've been here a couple of hours already. If we're just picking up your sister. Where's the robot? Ah, uh, someone took it away. Said they'd leave it in the workshop for your sister to take a look at. Are you even listening to me, Pax? I'm worried we won't make it to Winnemucca by tomorrow evening. If we miss our first booking, the agent might report us to justice. What I'm doing here will help us both. We stand a better chance of getting to Nova Scotia with my sister on the crew. And you know we'll all benefit from bringing another anomal. I'm not arguing that. I'm saying it's been an hour already, and you don't seem any closer to finding your sister. Another hour, maybe two, and we'll be on our way. One more hour, but then we're leaving. can't trust Annie to lead us. Not any- Hey! Theo! What do you need? This door open. It's locked? I called you. Fair point. Uh, will someone shoot at us? Doubt it. Okay. We can't trust Annie to lead us. Not anymore. She has her own agenda. She doesn't respect what Liberty was all about. The game was played, the game was played, and she did win it. She never won. She wasn't good at winning. She was she was good at making, but she played. The game played, the game she played. The game isn't fair. It's not made to be fair, even though I can shape and reshape and build it and build it and build it and build it and build it. The game just isn't fair. It's rigged. All the games are rigged. I know because I can I can see it in the code. I can dig into the code. I can see the lines of the code and I can see that it's rigged. The game is rigged. The game is up. They can't fool me because I I play the game. I I play the game. I play the game. It's like food. Making food. The code is like food. There are instructions and rules. Hey. There are rules. There's chemistry. There's chemistry and circuitry, like a recipe for food, like food, like making code to be played. The game is played through code and circuits and electricity. We make the game. We play the game. We see the game. I see it. All the bits are racing around and around and around and around. The game was played. The game was played. The game was played, and she didn't win. She never won. She wasn't good at winning. She was. She was good at making, but she Z. played. The game played. The game she played. The game isn't fair. It's not made to be fair, even though I can shape and reshape and build it and build it and build it and build it. And build it. The game just isn't fair. It's rigged. All the games are rigged. I know because I can. I can see it in the. Car. I can dig into the code. I can see the lines of the code. And I can see that it's rigged. The game is rigged. The game is up. They can't fool me because I, I play. The, I, I play the game. I play the game. It's like food. Like making food. The code is like food. There are instructions and rules. There are, there are rules. There's chemistry. There's chemistry and circuitry. Like a recipe for food. Like food. Like making code to be played. The game is played through code and circuits and electricity. We make the game. We play the game. We see the game. I see it. All the bits are racing around and around and around and around. The game was played, the game was played, the game was played, and she didn't win. She never won. She wasn't good at winning. She was she was good at making, but she played. The game played, the game she played. The game isn't fair. It's not made to be fair, even though I can shape and reshape and build it and build it and build it and build it. Build it. The game just isn't fair. It's rigged. All the games are rigged. I know because I can, I can see it in the car. Code. I can dig into the code. I can see the lines of the code, and I can see that it's rigged. The game is rigged. The game is up. They can't fool me because I, I play the game. I, I play Ziggy. the game. I play the game. It's hey, like food. Like making food. The code is like food. There are instructions. I know you can hear there me. There are rules. There's chemistry. There's chemistry and circuitry, like a recipe for food. Come like on, food. Like making code to be played. The game is played through code and circuit. Stop. I'm really sorry, but I need you to listen. We don't have a lot of time, and I'm never coming back here. So, yeah, please, listen. And please say something. Why the hell should I say anything to you? You're just a fucking bully. 
Well, you weren't listening. Oh, and you don't wonder why that is? I have nothing to say to you. You ran out on me, and now you expect to carry on like the last 15 years never happened? Stop saying I ran away. You know that's not the case. What are you saying? Um, Mom sent me away. Bullshit. Are you serious? Z, they had their reasons. I messed up. Used my Vox when I shouldn't have. They sent me away to protect me. You, all of us. I hated it, but I didn't have a choice. I was 16. But you know this already. They told you, right? They told me you ran away because you did. I don't know why you keep denying it. Oh, God. I can't believe... Z, I'm telling the truth. How can I believe anything you say? You're a con artist, a liar. You always were. Why would moms lie to me? No. That's... No, no you're full of shit, Pax. Why did you come back? I don't understand why you couldn't just stay away. Would have saved us a lot of heartache and misery. I came back to give us all closure. I never had the opportunity to say goodbye to anyone. And since I'm not planning on returning, this is our last chance. And a chance for you to escape. We're leaving the Republic. And I want you to come with us. What the fuck are you talking about? No, P Pax, I'm good. This is my home, my life. Annie needs me, I'm staying here. Why? Liberty's not what it was. You must see that. There's no future Look, just here just because for it's changed doesn't mean it's not home. If you stopped clinging to the past, you'd see that. I'm the one clinging to the past. You're the one living in your childhood bedroom, hiding out in our pretend castle, holding onto my meme like, like it's some sort of good luck charm. Fuck you, go away. Just leave me be. A robot driver got damaged by one of your golems? I'd be more than happy to fix that for you, if it helps you leave. My... Mm. The meme. I looked for it earlier in in your room it, is that seriously is that the real reason you came back for this thing i guess it makes sense you lie about running away you lie about the reason you came back are you planning to sell this make a quick buck fine fuck it take it i don't need it i don't need you I left this behind on purpose, kid. It was the only thing I could leave that Ziggy would care about. Even if it was broken. I guess she fixed it? It's a miracle it still works. Although I can't imagine it does much aside from play music. I mean, the echoes are long gone. So even if it did do more, it'd be useless to us but to nova scotia it could be worth a fortune and if so we'll be set for life kid everything we'd need to hide away forever anyway time to head out we got what we came for i don't think ziggy's changing her mind Not anymore. You're still here. Freaks everywhere. You're not welcome. I thought I'd made that clear. Like mother, like daughter. What did you call me? Why? You planning on using your freak powers on us? Go on. Do your worst. It'll only prove I'm not looking for a fight. Not so tough when you don't have your crew around, huh? She's just a little bitch. Come on, let's go and... No. Not this time. I'm not gonna let a deviant push me around. It's time someone stood up to these people. 
We're not gonna let you turn us into degenerate monsters. No one's turning anyone into anything. Stop putting voices into my head! We can't trust Annie to lead us. Not anymore. She has her own agenda. She doesn't respect what Liberty was all about. That really hurt. I'm gonna make you pay for this, see? What's eating her anyway? She's acting like a real freak. If she broke my meme, I'm actually gonna murder her. The world is once again in need of Pat, ghost-busting heroin with her meme beam machine. I see you, and don't even try your whispers on me, buddy. You don't stand a chance against me and my meme, man. Let's go, Echo. It's just meme against you. Easy. You're all going down today. There's no escaping Paxtusborn. A born go- Busted. See? 
Where are you? She can't I'm get warning to you, Z. There are ghosts in our neighborhood. I'll be in trouble. You better watch out. Big trouble. No. I hear the whispers. There you are, causing trouble. Don't you dare find. touch my sister. Can't matter. She'll. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop scaring me. Please. I ain't afraid of no ghosts. Too much. It's all part of the deep state plan. They're controlling the You're busted, ghost. Stop, stop now you get to live inside me. my meme forever. <laughs> Where are they coming from? Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop scaring me. Engaging in real shit. You are sacrificing yourself. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. She can't get to me. Don't let her get to me. I'll be in trouble. Big trouble. No. And they're coming. Can't find her. Can't find her. We're seeing air in the elevator because we don't know. What are you doing under there? Go away! You're messing with my head! I hear you whispering to me! Awful I'm things! I'm not doing anything. It's the echoes, the ghosts, see? They're the ones messing with your head. So make them stop! They're in my thoughts! I got rid of them all. There were no echoes left. I don't understand why. Hold on, Z. I'm gonna check something. Ziggy... Okay, I don't want you to panic, but there is an echo inside your head. Take it, go away! I don't want it there! Don't worry, I'll take care of it. No ghost messes with my little sister. She can't get to me. Don't let her get to me. I'll be in trouble. Big trouble. No! See? Are you okay? Can you hear me? I... I can hear you. The whispers. They're gone. Are you okay? I feel okay. What happened? The echo got into your head somehow. Never seen that before. But I fixed you. Thank you. Anything for my little sis. No matter how bad you smell. You smell. Fair play. Hey, if you feel better, maybe after dinner you want to go down to the field and play baseball? Yeah, sure. That'd be nice. Of course, I'm not gonna go soft on you, even if you are almost eaten by a demon. Of course. Stay here. I'm gonna check for more echoes. Don't worry, you'll be fine. I won't let them get into your head again.
Let's go. Moms will be furious if we're late for dinner. Race you? I'll give you to the count of five. One, two, three. Stand down, Fred. Moon. What the fuck? Fred, just back off. She has a fucking... We see how it is, Annie. You're on their side. We won't forget. Oh, do shut up, Fred. You're not yourself. None of you are. Go cool down. Leave my daughter and her friends be. They're guests. They're fucking deviants is what they are. And their sickness is contagious. Let's go, Wynn. We'll deal with her later. Was the gun really necessary? You saw what happened. People on edge. Liberty has an echo problem. So the ghosts are back. Huh. I thought so. They're not ghosts, Mom. Ghosts, demons, whatever you call them, they're unnatural. I don't see them like you do, Pax. I just feel them. I hear the whispers, and they're evil. Ziggy said you came for your magic box. She also said that's the only reason you came back. It's not a magic box. You know what I mean. And it's not true. I came back because I needed to make peace with my past. And it's not like I didn't try talking to Z. She's been angry with you for a long time. It'll take some time for her to listen. Where is Z now? Pax. She's not coming with you. This is her home. And it's falling apart. You're carrying a gun. Is this the life you want for Z? This used to be paradise, and now... Oh, you sound like Fred. This was never paradise. It was home. Liberty can be fixed, and you can help by using your magic box to... Sorry. Your thing to hunt those ghosts down. Once they're gone, things will return to normal. You did it before. You can do it again. Normal? Running drugs, arming people with guns, worshipping a pagan goddess? It's our normal. It's the life we've made for ourselves. I'll help you get rid of the echoes. I'll use my magic box to bust ghosts. And then we leave. Without your sister, she's staying here where she belongs. Don't go without saying goodbye to me and to Rosa. Let's go hunting ghosts. We need a handful more. Our Lord and Savior, kid. Father of the Republic. I guess it's not entirely his fault this place turned into Nazi Germany. Another reminder, this was a prison camp for children, kid. Can you imagine that? Hello, darkness, my old friend. Three should probably do it. Jesus! 
Jesus! What was that? WTF. Lucent squid from another dimension. Are you trying to steal my Finally! So at least you're not invincible. Whatever you are. Okay, you have to tell me what's going on because I'm about to freak the fuck out. You're running around with that weird retro handheld game dingus and headphones and like, what? I'll try to explain what's going on. Thank you. I mean, I know you're busy, and we're in a rush, but holy shit, dude! Uh, an explanation would be very much appreciated. You've heard about whispers of the noise? The noise? The broadcast. I keep forgetting you didn't grow up here. We called it the disorder, but yeah, the whispers. Wasn't that just a bullshit conspiracy theory? They're real. They're like... Fragments, echoes of disinformation left behind after the disorder. And I can uh, see these echoes, like uh, sonar sees submarines, but I need this thing to do it, the meme. I am so confused. So there's this device. I recognize that, the meme. A portable gaming console from the 90s, made right here in America. It was a flop, but it's rad. Sure. Uh, except this one has been modded. Modded? Someone took the shell of the meme and put different hardware into it. And when I plug in a special cartridge, it helps me see and record echoes. I, I put headphones on and hold the meme up, and it scans for whispers. Echoes. Okay, you're losing me here, girl. I think the best way to explain this is to show you. Yeah, th this is fine. Fine. I'm not at all freaked out by any of this. I'm doing really well with this new information. So, you use that thing to find echoes? The meme buzzes when they're close. Uh-huh. And what are these echoes? Sonic leftovers of the disorder. They float around or attach themselves to places and people. And when they do, they could really mess you up. So I use this to record the echoes. That makes them go away. I'll show you. Let's go hunt. Um, the whispers. The whispers, they're, they're gone. Oh, thank you, Jane. Whoa, that's a pretty dramatic transformation. So, when you say echoes mess you up, they're pure disinformation designed to induce fear, pain, resentment, confusion. Echoes can make infected people do crazy stuff, believe the worst things, spiral into a maelstrom of conspiracies. Maelstrom of conspiracies. Bad name. I think I'm starting to get it. So, what's happening here in Liberty? Echoes, messing with people, reappearing after decades. 
I thought I got rid of them all when I was a kid. But they're back. They're right. You're a failure and a disappointment to everyone. You're um, I I'm sorry, I don't... I didn't mean any of that. Anomals aren't the problem. We have other problems that need to be fixed here. I have to speak with Fred. The disorder was 30 years ago. How can these echoes still be around? I don't know, but there are more of them now. And the Camp Karens are infected? Making them susceptible to conspiracies, superstition, uh, emotional manipulation, fear and anger. So like social media. Sure. And the memes like a moderator removing disinformation and storing them in device memory. Why? How? I'll show you, soon as we've recorded one more echo. Do you think this is why that Fred lady is so messed up? It would make sense. She's saying some crazy stuff, like vocals being infectious. Things you'd hear from lunatics and justice propaganda. Well, you know what some people say. Anything's possible. Uh, what? What was I saying? I deserve love. I'm not a failure. The voices are wrong. Excuse me, I, I need to find the others. That's it. We got enough echoes stored in memory. Now we can mess around with the recorded audio to make new Vox. Uh, what? Well, not completely new, and it only works on me. My Vox are still all about the bad feels, but I learn new ways to mess with people. That's pretty huge, dude. So, now you know my ulterior motive for coming back here. To get the meme. Eh, uh, I get why this was not something you could talk about. How do you even explain this shit to anyone? So, are you gonna craft some words? It worked. I did not think it would. You have new vocals? What do they do? I don't know. Not until I try them out. <laughs> 